If you've been out to eat recently, you may have noticed a lot of folks are dining out, whether it's the desire to just get out of the house or spend stimulus money. Diners are fueling a restaurant rebound. News 4 Tucson's Shelly Jackson has the story. A year ago, most Tucson restaurants were struggling to keep their doors open. But now, as the city emerges from the pandemic, diners are hungry to eat out. We've seen a tremendous uptick, particularly since March 28th, when a number of the significant restrictions were lifted on restaurants in southern Arizona. Well, we've seen a small up in business. This is a trend seen across the restaurant industry. According to Open Table, restaurant business is 90% of what it was in 2019. We're doing similar, if not better, numbers than what we were doing pre pandemic right now. A MasterCard report finds April marks the second consecutive month of positive growth for the restaurant industry, with spending at restaurants up nearly 119% versus 2020 and up nearly 6% compared to 2019. Barrio Charo opened during the pandemic, so it really can't compare current sales. But chef Julian Alarcon says the demand is there. The restaurant recently expanded to offer dinner, and it is accommodating more diners inside. About a month ago, we only had three tables inside the restaurant. So now we opened it up to double that amount, and then uh, we're actually going to add a few more tables in, probably by the end of this month. Vaccines have also done a lot to shift the perception of indoor dining. Open Table says nearly a third of diners say eating inside is low risk. 70% say restaurant safety is very important. You know, some guests request, you know, a table outside, you know, they call and says, are you still spread out six feet apart? And while it looks like the restaurant industry is rebounding, there are still some challenges. We've got tremendous product shortages. We've got product spikes, increases in cost, and we're still struggling with labor availability right now as well. Kruger is even optimistic heading into the slow summer season. With what we've been seeing over these last couple of months, we think we're going to hit the ground running this summer and it should carry all the way into the fall season. And I don't know about you, but frankly, I'm tired of eating my own cooking. We've got you covered from the newsroom. Shelly Jackson, News 4 Tucson.